A couple of subscribers brought something to my attention, a technique that I swear wasn't possible a few years back, but is now extremely effective and means it's now possible to have infinite nanites in No Man's Sky. But something this top tier will have some little hiccups from time to time. So at the moment, I'm creating some nanites. As you can see here, I've only got 60,000 nanites. But let's create some more nanites. After extensive testing, one of the things you should do is not go over the 4,000 nanite mark because that seems to increase the chances of them disappearing. It's not a major issue, it's just a major inconvenience as you have to process the nanites again. 3,910 nanites, that's perfect. I've got five additional portable refiners. Let's carefully line up the first one so they perfectly blend together. It doesn't have to be 100%, but as close as possible. Then without moving, place the other four. When they're all in place, you can delete the five, but not the first one. Then I like to check the original portal refiner to make sure it still has the nanites. And then repeat that process over and over again. Place the five portal refiners, delete the five portal refiners, and then double check the original portal refiner. And if you pay attention to the top right corner, you can see I'm getting some carbon, some nanites, just under 20,000 at each time. And of course, the five portal refiners. I'll do that a few more times, then you can see how much I got. There you go, just under 138,000 nanites. But I have another approach for you as well. For the second technique, pull a wire like I'm doing right now. Now we're going to wire glitch a portable refiner to the end of the wire. By selecting the portable refiner, going into the wire menu, highlighting the electrical pickup points, and hitting wire in place at the same time. Platform buttons are in the bottom left hand corner now. And once that's done, you can start refining some nanites. Initially, this feels more complicated than the first method, but if you're proficient in the wire glitch, it's actually a lot easier. But there's another issue about it, but I'll get to that at the end. But before you start, make sure you have the five additional portable refiners already pre-made. To save time, I'll just stick with this one little batch of nanites. Now let's wire glitch the five portable refiners in place. And I'm doing this at real time speed so you get an idea how quick it is. Once you've glitched the five portal refiners in place, delete the five portal refiners. And if you're like me, you like to double check the original portal refiner to see if everything is still in place. We do that two more times, but without the check this time. This time the footage is at double speed, and then I'm going to explain why it might not work sometimes. You see here, this is the point it went wrong. I glitched in an additional portal refiner. The way the wire glitch works, it creates the item for free. It also means it wipes out the stored nanites. You still get all the nanites you duplicated, you just have to refine another base batch again. So this method is quicker, more efficient, but does come with that slight higher risk. I hope you liked the video, and if you did, hit that like and subscribe button, or on the bell thingy. And of course, thank you for watching. See you all later.